The eyes to the right, 202. The nose to the left, 432. So the nose have it. The nose have it. A crushing defeat for Theresa May. The British Prime Minister's divorce deal with the European Union rejected by a huge margin in a vote by British Parliament. It is clear that the House does not support this deal, but tonight's vote tells us nothing about what it does support. Nothing about how. Nothing about how or even if it intends to honour the decision the British people took in a referendum Parliament decided to hold. Today's no vote marks the worst parliamentary defeat for a British government in decades, with members of May's own party opposing the plan. The decision comes just 10 weeks before Brexit is set to go into effect March 29th. The uncertainty over what might happen next, leaving the world's fifth largest economy in limbo. One thing we can expect, opposition Labour leader Jeremy Corbyn going ahead with his push for a vote of no confidence in May's government. I have now tabled a motion of no confidence in this government. And I'm pleased, I'm pleased that motion will be debated tomorrow so this House can give its verdict on the sheer incompetence of this government and pass that motion of no confidence in the government. More than two years of talks and political posturing leading to today's crucial vote after Britain voted 52 to 48 percent in a referendum to leave the EU. Now there's the chance of a disorderly exit from the EU or even a U-turn, perhaps another referendum that could reverse plans to leave. May revealing tonight she is not resigning. As for the Labour leader's call for a no-confidence vote now set for tomorrow, there is a chance it could trigger a general election.